Today, ah. we are hitting 17 weeks. Everywhere. <laughs> I'm getting sick again. <laughs> Check this thing out. Here's a soft. Here's your pie. Oh, hold your bunny. He's so nice. Oh, there. E I E I O with a moo moo here and a moo here. Oh, hi there. We're reading a book. This is George's new favorite book. It has little animals that pop up the side of the page. It's so sad. And this soft. is just George's definition of a perfect afternoon. There, there, everywhere. I'm getting very coordinated with the pig noise. You are, you're good at it. And on this farm, he had some horses. E I E I O. With a <coughs> here and a <coughs> there, here, <coughs> there, <coughs> everywhere. <coughs> Yeah, It's the cutest. He started being snuggly for the first time in a year. He actually we, does love us. And we love it. It took him a year to like us. George, do you actually love us now? Yeah, he does. He also loves blowing bubbles. George, where's the bubbles? Where's the bubs? <gasps> Look, it's a bub. <laughs> Check this thing out. Hey, pregnant mama. Yeah. We're practicing hello. He does bye. Yeah. Okay. Good job. Good Today up. we are hitting 17 weeks of P R E G N A N C Y. Preg Nancy. Whose name are Nancy? Nancy Seely. Preg Nancy Seely. Here is the little bump. Oh, hi, bump. It's definitely growing larger. All night long, I just feel like I'm being squished from the inside out, which is a strange feeling that probably only pregnant women understand. And I'm getting sick again, it's weird. All, like I wake up at night sick, I wake up in the morning sick. I'm pretty good in the afternoon. Mm. Mm. <laughs> but where's the pups? Don't feel like my skin is flourishing like it did last time. I felt like with George I became like a skin model, but this time it's just kind of like struggling a bit. I don't know. How so? I don't know, I get acne. Or oh. last time it like cleared up all the way. None of my bras fit, so we have to go buy those. Fun. And wearing maternity clothes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I almost want to wear buy maternity clothes for me because these are the comfiest yeah. pants I've ever felt in my entire life. I mean, these babies are good. His hands don't. Like it. Yeah, he misses them too. Yeah. Dallin and George. These are from <laughs> Ann Taylor's maternity section and they're great. Okay, no one else. I'm 17 weeks. The baby is as big as a turnip. I don't really, I've never really eaten a turnip, so I can't really like relate to that. Still a girl. Still don't have any names. Um, okay, it's your turn. Well, we have like 20 names with George. We didn't name him till like two days after he was born. Oh, this is my first baby. Luna gets a little jealous, huh? Wait, oh, a A little jealous. Oh. Hey, tell me everything. What is it? Oh, tell us more. Oh. Wait, show them your chick. Where's your nose? Where's your nose? Yes. Oh, good job. I did it. That's it. That's your nose. That's your nose. Where's my nose? You did it. It's right in that area, yeah. Nose is. Noses. Oh, yeah. Hey. What's the plan? So the plan today, and probably a lot of people are going to think I'm crazy, but I don't care. I have some time on my hands and I have a baby, so. I, my sister homeschools all her kids and she found this sweet curriculum for me. And it's not like, it's not like intense or anything. It's just like some moms are really good at just being like, oh, I want to do all these fun activities and I'm just going to organize it and do it and it'll be great. I'm not that girl. I just need someone to be like, this is developmentally appropriate and good for your child and fun, which is what this is. But it has, um, it's just like a little one year old like activities you can do and it has like songs to learn and poems to it's like with hand motions to do with your baby and I think the goals of this like one year old preschool are just like learn your colors and body parts and there's 25 signs that you can teach them and 
It just has fun activities and you can make like a little binder and good language and it tells you good books to read each week. It's just like three days a week and I'm kind of excited because like instead of just being like, what do I do with you all day, child? I have a plan. Now I just need them to tell me what to feed him. There's probably a book for that too. So now we're gonna go to Walmart and buy supplies. Yeah, we just need like little things like some jumbo crayons and a little kid paint. I don't know what you want. Okay, let's go buy bras and crayons. So we just got to Walmart and George did not cry one time. Um, is it because he's maturing? Because he's growing up? It's because of these. Because of dum-dums. Dum-dums. Just hold it by himself the entire ride. He still needs to be kind of observed during it because he goes from like sucking it to like putting it in his hair to rubbing it on his car seat. But he's happy and he's learning. I don't care if he learns to be happy in the car seat. I just want him to learn how to hold a dum-dum and be happy. But we do want him to learn to be happy in the car seat. But I think one leads to the next. Holding the dum-dum leads to being happy in the car seat. Only issue is he's like a typhoon of stickiness. He said this one doesn't taste nearly as good as the last one. Mm, mm, what's wrong with it? Mm, mm. Is that your emergency store dum-dum? Yeah, only if we need it. Hey, that's, the wrapper's still on. Oh, I don't. Mm. Pom poms, glue. Those are gonna be fun, George. Construction paper, teacher grade. So we had to pull out emergency sucker number two. He's loving it, but he is also a ginormous slobber monster. If you come to the Walmart in Centerville, you do, do not use this cart. The hand just stuck to it. All the things. George! I know. <laughs> are you ready to learn some stuff on Saturday? Thanks. What do you got laid out here, Mama? You ready? Can we read a book? <gasps> this is our book this week. <gasps> Colors! That's our color. Black. Black. scribbles and then he's done for one second. Can you say bye? Bye bye, baby. Bye bye. There you go. There you did a little bit. Bye. Oh, bye bye. Bye bye. Um. Let's taste some pumpkin flavored candy. It's better than a normal cake. We got a pumpkin spice wafer. 